Hey folks, it's Dr. Gersmar from Aspire Natural Health. And in this quick video, I want to talk to you about whether you should take probiotics on a full stomach or an empty stomach. Now, if you've read around the internet, you found there's a lot of differing opinions about this. And since probiotics can be quite pricey, we don't want to be throwing away our money. So, which is it? Should you take your probiotics on an empty stomach in between meals or on a full stomach with meals? Why does this even matter? Well, the issue here is stomach acid. As you know, the stomach is normally full of acid, which helps us to digest our food and can be a problem when it goes back up our throat and causes heartburn or GERD. Now, one of the jobs of stomach acid is to kill off bacteria that come into our digestion when we eat or drink anything. And studies have shown that people who take antacids, especially on a regular basis, are more likely to get both lung infections like pneumonia and gut infections, including SIBO. So the concern is with all that acid in our stomach, are we just burning up the probiotics that we're putting in? So let me clear up this confusion for you. Now, when the stomach is empty, there is less acid in it. When we eat, we stimulate the stomach to produce more acid in order to digest our food. So the thought behind taking probiotics on an empty stomach is that no food equals less acid equals more bacteria surviving. Makes sense, right? Unfortunately not. You see, while there is less acid in the stomach, the actual acidity, how acidy or burny the stomach is, is actually higher. Now, when we eat food, more acid is put out, but that acid is, if you will, soaked up by the food and the actual acid level in the stomach is lower, meaning less of your probiotics will be destroyed by the acid in our stomach when you take them with a meal. This also jives with our ancestral understanding of what's going on as well. I mean, think about it. Probiotic supplements, whether they're pills or powders, have only been around for a short period of time. How did we get our beneficial bacteria back in the day when we didn't have any probiotics? And the answer is from our food, from fermented foods, and from the dirt. So we're getting a big chunk of probiotics when we ate. Now today, most of us eat pretty clean foods without a lot of dirt on them, and a lot of people don't eat real fermented foods anymore, or even really get out in the dirt and nature much. So probiotics have become a necessary supplement for many people, and we can mimic how our ancestors got their beneficial bacteria by taking ours with food. So there you have it. Should you take probiotics on a full stomach or on an empty stomach? And the answer is, on a full stomach with our meals. Now, if you or anyone you know is dealing with heartburn or GERD, I'd like to offer you an expert guide on how we treat and help people with GERD here at Aspire Natural Health. All you need to do is fill out the short form that's below and we'll happily send that to you for free. So please click down below and fill out the short form. At Aspire Natural Health, we're experts at treating digestive issues and autoimmune diseases. If that's you, we'd love to connect. We offer a no obligation, no pressure chat to see if we can help you and if we're the right fit to work together. If we are, we'll move forward. If we're not, we'll do our best to connect you with a person who can best help you. You have nothing to lose, so please call us now at 425 202 78 or email us at info at aspirenaturalhealth.com. All right, folks, until next time, take care.